This is a question about diagrams and electronegativity and ionization energy. One thing to remember about these diagrams is that the nucleus is below and there may be empty orbitals above, but what we are focusing on in the boxes is the valence band, which is where interesting things happen. So, if we want to look for the atom that is the most electronegative, this is the one that is going to be most likely to gain an electron. So, if I look at where an electron can go in element X, it certainly cannot go down here because the um, orbital is full with two electrons. However, we can put an electron up here. So that's our choice for where to place an electron for x. If we look at y, we cannot put any electrons here, but there is an empty spot here, so I will draw a box to show the empty spot here. And if we look at z, we seem to have an empty spot right here on this lowest energy orbital. So I can see that the one most likely to gain an electron is, in fact, C, because it has the lowest energy empty space. The one that is least likely to gain an electron is going to be X, because it has the highest energy empty space. Now if we want to look at ionization energy, remember that ionization energy occurs when we lose an electron. And when we lose that electron, that means we're going to take it way up to the top of the diagram. So I'm going to circle each electron that we're thinking of losing. For X, it could be one of these two electrons. For Y, we have a choice. It could be this upper electron or one of these two lower electrons. But remember, when we are going to remove electrons, we're going to remove the one that is at the highest energy. For Z, our only option is, of course, this valence electron. So, when we think about taking these electrons and removing them all the way to the ceiling right here, I would say that the one with the highest first ionization energy is X, because I have to drag it the longest distance to go to the ceiling. On the other hand, the lowest first ionization energy will be Y, because that electron is closest to being removed away from the nucleus.